congratulations on the show. I really loved it. Thank you. To kick us off, um, can you tell me, were there any similarities between you and your character Liv? Yes, there were. Um, I, we, <laughs> it was fun to kind of play that line of being bold and then being quite absurd and I believe Liv moves into the absurd and I stay in the bold world but yeah there's you know we're both kind of loud out there characters so that was kind of I think where we stayed close. And what's the worst wellness activity you've ever done personally? I had a colonic and it was horrible. That is the worst thing I've ever done. I had to have it. I didn't do it because I was like, oh, I'm bored. I had to do it and it was nasty. I mean, I felt like I was walking on clouds after it. I felt pretty amazing. But at the time I was like, this is not pretty. What went wrong? Well, they stuck a hose in my bum. That's what went wrong. <laughs> Nothing went wrong. It was just weird. The whole thing was just kind of weird. I'd had, yeah, I, I had, I, like I said, I had to have it done. And I was just like, I don't think I need to do this again. It's a lot. <laughs> There's a hosing out scene in the show. Um, did you know JJ well before you did that scene? Yes, I knew, I knew JJ well. I just don't think you ever know anyone well enough for them to be analysing the faecal matter that comes out in a tube, you know what I'm saying? I mean, like, I don't even need to be a part of that if my husband gets it done. That's, that's nasty. But JJ is a very good sport. She's a queen of woman. I love her. There's also a nude scene and you're very, you look very uncomfortable like with Miranda. Mm. What was it like filming that? Amazing. I absolutely loved every second of it. That was a complete dream come true to be able to film with Miranda. Oh no, like I lost my mind. I had a moment when we were filming, when we were like just doing different setups where I had to take myself away and had a little cry. I was like, oh my God, I finally, I can't believe I'm working with Miranda. And then I went back down, they're like, cool, clothes off. And I was like, all right, here, Miranda, cop this. So it was, it was awesome, it was great. How did you guys break the ice when you just like dropped your robe? Well, we weren't completely naked. We, no, we, there's, there's trickery and different things that happen. So it was, and she's kind and amazing and professional and you know, one of the greatest actors in the world. So I was kind of said and led by her actually. I was like, however you kind of, you know, navigate this is how I'm gonna do it. And it was, it was awesome, but we weren't completely naked. Or were we? We weren't. Were there any cameos that you were hoping to get for the show? So obviously you wanted to get her. Yeah, we got Aidan Young as well, which was awesome. Um, so no, the cast and the cast as is, it was perfection. We were so, so happy. And to be able to get Aidan as and and Miranda, I was like, what is going on here? This is this it was the best. Did you guys do much improvising at all? Yeah, there was a bit. It's always fun to dick around on set and it's a comedy you can't you know you, you've got to lighten it up you've got to it, it it filters in you know when you're doing fun content and all that sort of stuff it, it filters into the set and that was a big a big thing for me it had to be fun it has to be fun or why we're we doing it do you have any behind the scenes stories that you can share oh no not one because what happens on st set stays on set no we'll, we'll probably release some sneaky little stuff later i reckon but otherwise, they were long days and we shot all on location so people were delirious at times, which was the best time to mess around with people. But um, no, no, I'm, I'm going to keep those. I'm going to keep those close. Were you excited to play this character that could just be so headstrong and do whatever she wanted? Is that like some sort of a message that you want to like oh, be yourself? Absolutely. I, I loved the re the, I love this character mainly for that reason, that she just did what she wanted. She's so bold, she's so boots and all, she throws everything at a wall and whatever sticks, she just goes with it. Whatever we're doing, let's go. And that was so fun to play and such a great message. Do what you need to do. Different strokes for different folks, right? Like if something works for someone, it might not work for someone else, whatever, but if you're gonna do it, just go all in. And that's what I love about this character. She is all in. Do you wish you had someone that was like that when you were growing up to tell you, like, don't worry about what other people think? Yeah, I kind of did. My sister is, uh, I got a little bit of my sister and put her in this character. She's quite brave and boots and all and will try anything and is up for anything. So I, I was pretty lucky to have a, a cool sister like that. And my mum and my dad, like, you know, it was, it was nice.